Intelligent Asia opened on Wednesday, the largest international expo to be held in Taiwan since the pandemic began. Thousands of visitors are expected to, de to descend on Nangang Exhibition Center to check out the innovations displayed. At the launch, Vice President Lai Qingde spoke about the recent sales of China-based Taiwanese factories to Chinese rivals, calling on industry to embrace the smart revolution. This machine revolves on the spot and occasionally sprays the air with disinfectant. It's a disease prevention robot, a highlight of the expo. Intelligent Asia launched at Nangang Exhibition Center on Wednesday, and the pandemic is still a big focus. As UVC walks along, it is disinfecting the venue. The spray on the top has various application domains in different locations. Basically, if we fill it with disinfectant or ionized water, then it serves to disinfect the space. The launch ceremony was attended by Vice President Lai and Economics Minister Wang Meihua. Recently, there have been high-profile cases of Taiwanese firms planning to sell factories to Chinese competitors, including Western sale of Apple assembly lines to Luxshare. A large phone body manufacturer, Catcher Technology, intends to sell plants in China's Taizhou to Lens Technology, pulling out of the Apple production chain. Lai commented directly on the impending sale. Catcher makes phone bodies. They sold 40 percent of their shares in China. Why? So they can turn toward 5G and artificial intelligence and robots. We must adopt the correct strategic position. Lai called on Taiwan's tech industry to reposition themselves like Katcha on the smart bandwagon. As the U.S.-China trade war turns into a tech war and the pandemic shakes up global markets, it's important for Taiwan to grab its opportunity, he said.